to the uh, Friends of Amateur Rocketry site mm -hmm. in Kern County to launch our bamboo rocket and our um, Dr. Knight's uh, high power rocket, which is the Black Brand X. It's about 10 feet tall, but it's a little taller because we added a camera, mm -hmm. um, camera payload, so that took up like about 10 inches of space. But uh, so right now we're on the freeway. Um, are we about halfway there? Well, we're just crossing over the San Andreas Fault. And maybe you can show them out there that lake right in the middle of San Andreas Fault. Wow, that actually looks really cool, kind of cool. A lot of people drive by here didn't know that. It's kind of unfortunate also that the California aqueduct, which brings a large supply of water to Southern California, is right here on the San Andreas Fault, mm -hmm. which is not a good, a good idea. Alright everyone, I'm gonna show everyone. Yeah, say hi everyone. Hi. Say hi to the camera if you wanna be in the video. Guys, this is our first field trip for yeah, the team. Field trip. Yeah, 2017, 2018. Yeah. <laughs> so, go ahead, Dr. Knight. I was gonna say, and the, all these wind turbines are out here, and we're very happy that they're not turning right now. Even though they would be great if they were making renewable energy, we're really glad that they're not turning right now so that we have a calm day to fly our rockets and our drones out in the desert. Yeah. And then you can see over there the airplane boneyard. Okay, got the light class. We're gonna try and take some pictures with the Vives camera. Um, right now we're going to put the altimeter into our nose cone and this is just going to re record the altitude that the rocket flies to. Um, so I'm taking out these screws that I put here so that we wouldn't lose them. And then uh, the, the altimeter, the base plate will fit over into this mm -hmm. hole and then it'll screw in where the screws are right now. Okay. So the motor's in, right? The motor's in, you can show it to them. Um, we're using an I motor. So motors are categorized by the um, by letter. So really small ones are A and then bigger ones are, they, they go down the alphabet and um, motor classification, every letter is twice as powerful. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna get a very big motor by the time you get to an I motor. Um, All right, yeah. Um, so right now we're waiting for this other group to launch their small mom rockets. Um, so we're just gonna wait for them to finish and then we're gonna go to the launch pad and against our bamboo rocket over there. Wait, do you know what group this is? Do you guys know what this is? This what group scouts. this is? I have no idea. Apparently they're Boy Scouts. They are? Okay, so right here, um, the, the Boy Scouts are launching their rocket. This is a Boy Scout troop. So we're waiting for them to finish their launch before we go on to the field to uh, set up our rocket for the launch. We're just gonna finish their rocket. Okay, I mean, it counts. And I followed the people and I didn't do anything on it. I was like, you're banned from your boss. Like, the Twitter told me I'm a robot. I thought you would have done something worse. No! I don't know, there we go. Oh my god. I think they're like are progressively launching higher ones. They're like high, bigger motors. I think they're progressively. Oh, we got. Oh, these went a lot higher. Oh wow! Look at that beauty blush hat right here. So Surya is going over to. Yeah, Surya's got that bunker, and I'm going to record it with the drone. All right. Oh, so you're flying the drone. Surya's going to fly the drone and record a video of our rocket launch. So we're going to go get the rocket to the launch pad now. Doctor.
have this doesn't fully yeah. matter. Right. Here, so just do another video and we'll explain yeah. it. What I like so to do is take these okay. igniter leads and touch them yeah, together. Yeah. That way, if somehow this system was hot and it was powered, you'd know it now instead of cooking the igniter up to it and having the motor light your face. Yeah, so the igniter is the wire, the yellow wire that you see here that goes up into the motor and on the end of it there's an explosive compound. So um, it's on the exposed end. Well, okay, I'm sorry, flammable. <laughs> there's a flammable compound that um, went, oh, the rocket's sinking. Up here. Um, yeah, but so there's, there's a flammable compound on the exposed end of the wire at the end, which uh, when you run electricity through it, through those uh, alligator clips that you just put on the end of the igniter, um, it'll catch on fire and light the motor, and then the motor will burn and carry the rocket up. So why does the igniter have to go up through the top of the motor? Oh, okay, so the igniter has to go to the top of the motor because then when that part of the motor starts firing, it'll light it the here. bottom parts, because if, uh, if you just lit the bottom of the motor, the top of the motor will catch on fire at the same time, and you need the motor to burn evenly. Um, yeah, so, uh, as you can see, there's like a little red cap at the bottom, and that just keeps the igniter on the uh, motor uh, nozzle, on the nozzle of the motor. Um, and yeah, we're, we're just about ready to launch, so we're just gonna clear away from here, and then we're gonna uh, press the button. And if you see that drone over there, Surya is actually recording uh, the launch. Where is he? Surya's like on the bunker over is there. He on the bunker? And I think we've yeah. agreed uh, that Andrew is gonna push yeah, the Yeah, Andrew's gonna push the button. His idea. There he is. Good job, Andrew. He'll be famous or infamous, depending on what happens. Yeah. Four, three, two. Okay, so right now, uh, what happened is that the rocket did not launch when we when we uh, pressed the button. So we're going to, uh, well, not me, but Dr. Knight and Paul, if you can see them over there in the middle frame, they're going to go and look and see if the igniter uh, functioned correctly. And if it burned out and failed to ignite the rocket, they're going to replace the igniter with a new one. Okay, so Paul and Dr. Knight are coming back now, so I assume that means that the uh, igniter is uh, fixed about to somehow. The so either they replaced it or they like figured out what the problem was and they fixed it. So we should get the launch going soon. Okay, so Okay, so this is Dr. Knight's rocket that he built. Um, it's the Black Brand X. Um, so it's about 10 feet tall. It's a little taller than the normal model because if you can see up there, we've installed a camera. So we had to add a little bit of tubing for that to have room. Um, right now, Dr. Knight and Paul just twisted the wires of the alternator. He just said uh, he twisted the wires together, which uh, just connects the two, uh, the, the battery to the rest of the altimeter, and then the, that means the altimeter is charged armed I'm sorry and then that uh, the alternator is going to detect when the rocket reaches gravity and it's going to deploy a black powder charge to open up the rocket um, and just going to create um, well black powder will burn which will create pressure what's inside of the parachute um, the parachute bay which is going to open up the rocket there um, it's it's going to decouple and then the parachutes will come out and uh, the rocket will come down safely that's that's hopefully what's going to happen um, Dr. Knight's launching this rocket with the mm -hmm. G motor, so that's bigger than the one we launched yeah, um, the, the bamboo rocket with. Yeah, so we need a bigger one because this rocket's a little bit bigger than the mm -hmm. <laughs> Pretty huge, huh? Wait, why did...
Thank mm-hmm. you.